Good morning, family. Welcome to today's Lessons for Life. Uh, today is Wednesday, October 28th, 2009. It's a we're reading in Second Chronicles chapter 27. And as always, I encourage you to read these chapters too for yourself. This is a pretty short chapter, but uh, see what you get from me. Email us and put it on the blog. And just as I was reading it, it's something that came to mind. It's not really, you know, not all the topics I guess to talk about in the morning are so uh, quote unquote uh, religious in nature, but there's a lesson that we can learn, or there's something. Um, that we can learn from reading each and every chapter. Um, but this morning as I was reading this chapter, uh, it reminded me of a book that I read because it talks about how the king <coughs> set up the cities and the mountains and uh, castles and towers like in the forest. And it just reminded me of something I read in a book which I had not known before because it was talking about uh, someone who um, basically they by um, land in the mountains and so forth and they were mentioning and it reminded me like I said this morning of how the tops of the mountains are really uh, what's considered prime real estate um, so you know not when you when you consider going to the mountains or you know buying land or something in the mountain not all land is considered equal the mountain top is actually considered the prime because you can actually see everything that's going on around you have a view so uh, I guess even in the the um, days before, <coughs> then people could see if someone was approaching or if you know uh, someone was coming to uh, attack them or whatever. So the prime real estate in the mountains is the uh, like the mountain tops, and I believe this is where they're saying the king built cities in the mountains, so the cities were up high, so that they can see the different things that were going on around them. And then they had to bring, build the towers and castles in the forest because then those had to be raised up so they can then see, you know, they had to build up so they could see what was going on around them. So uh, what I got from this, I wanted to just share, like I said, something I had learned when I was reading this particular book. But it reminded me, and I'll share it with you uh, today for Lessons for Life, about the different uh, real estate in the mountain, mountainous areas. The prime one is really the one that's on top that sits above that can see everything that's going on around it. Um, so that's really all I'm going to share <laughs> this morning. Um, but like I said, I encourage you to read these chapters too for yourself. There was something else actually I could share with a more uh, quote-unquote uh, religious uh, nature. But that this was the first thing I got and I just wanted to share it because I probably won't speak about anything like this again as we go through the rest of the Bible. So with that, create yourself a wonderfully blessed, wonderfully blessed,